What's up guys? Hey, how you doing? My name is Lynette in case you're here. Hi and welcome to the family in case you're not subscribed. Make sure you do so and don't forget to hit the post notification bell that you're notified whenever I upload a video. So guys, in today's video we're going to be dealing with our hair. I'm going to be showing you how to apply the echo styler, the gel onto your hair and make it sit for like two to three days or more. Um, I don't like mine sitting for a week or more than three, three days because of, um, you know, itching. Itchiness. What? Because of itching. Anyway guys, so like before we get to the video, I want to apologize for ghosting you guys for like for more than three to four weeks. I think it's around the fourth week. Actually, I think it's the fourth week. I'm not sure, but I think so. But I've ghosted you. I've gone long. And like, yeah, so um, I'm going to hit the shower right now, wash my hair. This is the second day with the gel. And as you can see, all I need to do is just lay my edges as little as they are. And then I'll be good to hit the road. So I'm going to wash my hair moisturize it what i'm going to <laughs> i'm going to wash my hair then apply treatment <laughs> i'm going to apply i'm going to <laughs> yo i'm serious now i'm going to wash my hair then apply my treatment then i'll be back showing you how to go about applying the gel okay there is a lot of sitting moisturize it because of i'm used to like wash your face i don't know apply this then moisturize it i don't know you know so like i don't know maybe we can call it moisturize it but i call it treatment here yeah, treatment so let me go and wash my hair then like i'll be back <sighs> moisturize it and we're back so guys um after i washed my hair this time my hair looks like it has shrunk so I'm just going to first of all just give it a light comb so that we don't um, stress it out. So like yeah, can stress. So like I'm um, going to comb it a little bit, then we're going to be using the radiant leave-in conditioner. Yeah, we're going to be using the radiant leave-in conditioner, so that's how it looks. <sighs> Allow me to comb my hair real quick, then I'll be back. So guys, we are going to let this set for like 30 minutes to an hour. You don't have to do this. If you want to um, apply a costella to your gel and then like go out, I would recommend you to do your washing like in the evening, not at night, in the evening, like around 4, 5, 6, around that time. Then apply your treatment. After you apply your treatment, you can do an awkward step, like matutas in your hair. Then like you leave it overnight. In the morning, you just comb your hair and then like apply the costella so like as, for, as of now because i'm making this video for you guys i'm going to leave it for 30 minutes until my hair absorbs the treatment and i'm going to use my towel as the head cap then i'll be back to show you how it looks and then we move on to the step of applying the costella so guys i'm going to leave it like this i've just used my towel as my head cap <laughs> it's allowed so like <laughs> Okay, I'm going to leave it like this for like 30 minutes. Then after 30 minutes are over, we are going to unwrap it, give it a little comb, then like proceed to apply the costella onto our hair. So like, let's wait. So guys, we're back. It's around, uh, I don't know what the time, but we said we'll set the hair for like 30 minutes or an hour. I'm not a patient person, so like, oh, 30 minutes it is. <laughs> so like, here we are. Uh, we're going to go through the process of like like applying the costella with you guys so this is my costella i'm using the the green one the one which has oil oil in it there's another one the one which has a red tip it has a Ghana oil but this one has oil i don't know the colorless one which choice it has but i don't know anyway i don't know so like i'm going to go in with this the costella so so we're back I'm just going to take a small amount of the pastel and then I'm going to apply it onto my head, onto my hair. <sighs> Thank you. 
So guys, <laughs> uh, through the process of making the have not been talking, so like I'm talking right now. So for the shampoo that I've used, for the shampoo that I've used, I've used the Miyari shampoo, this one. And it has such an amazing scent. I love it. I've been using this from last month, but one. This is what I've been using. For the hair treatment conditioner, <laughs> moisturizer. <laughs> moisturizer yeah it's a treatment I'm, I'm seeing moisturizer because you know what i said at the beginning of the video so like for the hair treatment um, i've used radiant living hair conditioning treatment i love it it has a cooling effect once you apply it on your hair and let it sit you have that um it's like a breeze a cool breeze <laughs> a cool breeze and i love it and uh lastly I'm going to be using this Move It Olive and Agana Oil. Yeah, I, if you can remember, I mentioned the other Eco Styler that has Agana Oil. So this one has Olive and Agana Oil, so it's a perfect combination because we had Olive Oil in the Eco Styler and then we have the Olive Oil in this spray. It's a Shin Hair Spray. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, <laughs> so like I'm going to spread this all over my head so that it can have a shimmer. shimmer. That my hair can shine and look all um, neat and beautiful too. Oh my gosh. So like after that, I'm just going to tap it in because there is a excess of the product lying on my hair. I'm going to do the same for my hairline, for my edges rather. <laughs> yeah, so. It's time for the photo session. I mean, okay, okay, normally in my videos I always have the introduction bit of me posing and doing all sort of childish behaviors. I don't know if it's childish, but I do like and I appreciate myself for that. So like, um, guys, this is what I have. This is the um, end of this video. Actually, we have come to the end of this video to put everything in a in a group. I don't know. Oh my gosh, I don't know so many things in this video. So like, guys, I'm going to leave um, the list of everything that I've used in the description except this. Obviously, this is a toothbrush, but there is a designated um, brush that you should use for your edges. I'm comfortable with it. I also use this Coco Designer Collection. They are made in China. These are black rubber bands. If you don't get to see them well, then put at them near the lenses of my camera. And then I use this brush. You can use any brush for me. My hair is kind of a bit rough, so I also use a rough brush. And then the brush. I use an Afro comb and pretty much that's it so guys in the next video i'll be doing a video of adding an extension to this bit so like definitely will not be seeing this bit i'll like braid it and then like add an extension if you'd like to see that video make sure you comment on the comment sections that i'll be able <laughs> so that i'll be <laughs> gosh so that i'll be able to make that video for you guys so guys um be sure be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you like it and don't forget to subscribe in case you have not yet. It's a red button right over here or here. I don't know where it is in your screen but make sure you click it and turn on the bell notification. Is that right? Anyway. So, let me just do a small suggestion and then we'll see you in the next video. Oh my gosh, the video is 22. That's so long. See you till next time. Bye. I love you. Kisses. Kisses, kisses, kisses.